<laughs> I've seen a lot. <laughs> Amen. I still see it. <laughs> that part. No, I two of them. Right there. Flashbacks. Bob, do you desire that light? That's what you need. Well, awesome. actually, what he said, David, your husband, oh. said is that when the light shines, it like it glows so much on the top of my head that it makes me invisible. Oh. <laughs> 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 And and I like being visible even though I am also invisible. Right, right. Okay. Did you say well, invisible or indivisible? Yes. Indivisible. With liberty and justice for all. I thought mm -hmm. it was gonna say then you have a halo. Yeah. I have one of those somewhere. Yes, I'm finding does. it. He does hey, no. Oh. Hey, hey, no. <laughs> hey. I just had one of the best meals ever. Mm -hmm. yeah. oh, yes. And about forty five thousand watts of light and raw chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> so good. Thought I'd just share that. Thank you, Yamaha. You're welcome. Intros are cool. Anyone? Yes. Yeah, everybody? Yes. There? This is Bob. <laughs> Hi, Bob. We're very blessed Karma. to have Bob. <laughs> I just said something like that to David earlier, like, well, how are we going to introduce it? Here's David. You just <laughs> 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 instantaneous manifestation. <laughs> okay, seriously, this is fun. Bob, intros, Bob's intros are always fun for me. When we do intros at David's house, you never really know what's going to happen. <laughs> so um, just take a deep breath and... Jump in for the ride. I'm excited. Thank you, Bob. Thank you, David. Welcome, everyone. Also, happy that you've come to visit with us in our home. Mm -hmm. Wow. Big vibration today. <laughs> Usually, when we do intros, they're just intros. And... Uh, tonight seems like there's a there's a, a gravity in the room, which is very cool, very cool. So um, I guess take a minute and um, just be uh, grateful for all the you know little travels that you took on your day to day to arrive here, and, and uh, we're very blessed that you joined us because you're adding to whatever is here this evening, which to me is palpable. So I met Bob in 2001. Our good friend John Schmidt invited Yemima to come hear this guy talking about linguistics. And I thought, yeah, 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 I've done that for years. I'm in the room for about 15 minutes with Bob, and I think, huh, I'll know Jack. <laughs> I'm going to check my ego and my stuff at the door and just pay attention to what this guy's got to, to uh, transmit to me because it was far beyond saying. So we had a, a great time in the ring with uh, Bob, and then for, I guess, about a year, year and a half or two, we pretty much went to everything that you guys had, you and Helena had going on at your center. And we absorbed. And I'm very uh, thankful for Bob. He's given me a lot of... of uh, great technologies to use in my relationship with my and my business and my personal relationship with my presence. So I recommend that you check in with your heart and any activities that Bob has uh, going on over the next uh, few days here in Austin and San Antonio is if you're able to attend and bring a friend do, and if you know people in San Antonio, uh, be sure and pass it along to them. And what's the best one place to find everything just on your Mastery website? Systems, yeah. MasterySystems.com, there's an event resume. Events, yeah. And then mm -hmm. scroll down three and there's an event calendar. Mm -hmm. And then scratch your left ear lobe and... <laughs> <laughs> do the dance. Yeah. <clears throat> So check in with your heart, and if you um, feel a strong inspiration to attend, do. 
even if it, you know you have things that appear to maybe be already on your plate, um, if you have an inspiration, just arrange to be there. Welcome, more people. Let's go. We got plenty of room. We saved a spot for you. Is that a good one? Yeah, that's good. Um, you know, when you said gravity, I was like, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm really, yeah, absolutely. I want to talk a little about that. I, I mean, I'm Matt Defu. That's a special word. I'm Matt Defu when it comes to doing intro. I can do them all day long. I love them. Tonight I'm going. I know it. <laughs> I'm just feeling I'm scared. Scared. Yeah, Me too. And you said gravity. It's like, dang, gone, baby. We're going to rock and roll tonight. And I don't have a freaking clue. <laughs> so, um, I mean that. That's pretty exciting for me. So, first of all, I honor David. I honor you, Maya as two of my closest friends on the planet. So love is so strong here. And in Austin, love is so strong. They've been coming here for so long now. It, I believe it's one of the seed energies on our planet is Austin, Texas. And I thank you, beloved Johnny Schmidt, for introducing me with this area and these glorious and many, many, many probably two or three thousand other people through John Schmidt. Mm -hmm. To introduce anything tonight, I, you know, I, I can share a lot, I can talk about conscious language, imagination activation, all kinds of stuff, and I can demonstrate, not just talk about, um, I can demonstrate, I'll say this, a shift in consciousness of which can change a person forever in a, a matter of a couple seconds. Is that true, those are moments? Yes. 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 And you can do it as well, yes? Yes. yes. That's the point. It's not just like a little Bobette running around. It's that there's some certain truths, and we can do them. So tonight, when I started feeling that <clears throat> our presence, really, may be greater than each one of us individually, Exactly. So, I don't know. Yeah, baby. So, uh, uh, we're going to horse around tonight, I can tell right away. Uh, oh, my God. I'll quiet folks down. Yes. So, um, how's about, let's do this so each person has a sense of what we have, because I honor every single, in every one of us tonight, personally. And I also honor our heart's call. I believe our heart's call is why I'm here. My own heart's call and also listening to the heart's call of what we have on our planet right now. And the, the miracles of manifestation are just waiting for us to see them, wake up to them, feel them. The illusion basically is over. How many know that's true? Yes. 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 How many know there's the last little spiral down the the toilet, and, and no judgment, yeah, just, you know, I mean, even flush it, I mean, it's a pretty interesting word, you know. come on now, I don't mess around, I mean, I say it like it is, yeah, flush it, I mean, look at the word, flush it, and that word's in there, yes, no judgment, how many know everybody does, have that thing, so, what's happening, in my view, is the restoration of our true nature. And for me, I discovered the aspect of language, which I have been active with since 1968, by studying the Hopi language. And the Hopi language, uh, I didn't study the Hopi, I studied someone who studied the Hopi called Benjamin Lee Worf, who wrote a book called Language, Thought, and Reality. I was 18 years young. And I just read Be Here Now by Ram Dass. How many know that great little psychedelic 8 by 8 book? You know, cosmic. And then I, I studied the Hopi language, which now I know is an operating system. All language is an operating system. So I didn't have that back then. Computers weren't around. I'm going to get it. In 68, it was like, you know, typing and all. I remember that. Maybe. All right. So the, the distinction I'm choosing to share is the, the illusion lack, limitation, struggle, is a belief system believed in. Yes or no? Yes. yes. And so we have, in my view, by studying language, and especially the Hopi, realizing like the Hopi, don't have a word for now, because they can't get out of now, to have to use the word now to get back to now. 
18, I'm going, what are you talking about? <laughs> I mean, really, truly. I was supposed to write my thesis in, you know, my, in a semester, and it took me a year and a half. And I didn't write any thought about my own at all. I only did quotes because it was so big for me to realize there is a culture with a language structure that's so here and now that they can't get out of here. There is no space for the Hopi. Like, the rock is not over there. I'm saying this in English, everybody. Mm -hmm. Got it? There, it's just like two computer languages that don't, they can't even at all relate to each other unless there's a correlation. So it's not about Hopi. What, this, what I'm sharing with you is that we have had a language structure called Babel, which means confusion, for maybe, it's been said, maybe 5,000 years. And so most of our DNA has been experientially imbued with automatic language structures <coughs> which define separation, lack, limitation, evil, good and evil, you know, eating from the fruit of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil and falling out of the consciousness of union, which is also called grace, where embarrassment, lack, limitation, shame, blame, guilt, dis-ease, want, struggle, exist, and other things. And those states of separation and lack are an illusion. The only way an illusion can exist is if I elude myself and keep alive the illusion through thought, word, feeling, and vision. I have to dialogue non-truth to have non-truth exist. I'm going to say it again. I actually have to keep alive the illusion because an illusion has no source within itself. I'm going to get that. Yes. Like an apparition isn't real. I'm going to get that. Yes. So to have lack or struggle or disease or want, which I'm not judging anyone if they have or don't have it. I'm simply saying they are not true unless we entruth them. Clear? Yes. yes. And so by studying in 1968 the Hopi language, I began to wake up to what language actually is. And it didn't happen instantaneously. I believe it's my mission in life. So of course I've been I've had spiritual sponsorship like we all have to remember this thing. I'm gonna get what I'm talking about. Yes. Yes. And I'm clear, I'm grateful, I'm clear, I'm grateful. I know that my little my little personality is my little personality. How many have one? Yeah. <laughs> what about the rest of you? Yeah. Yeah. Just check and see who else is in the room, yeah. How many have a couple? That's not such a good thing. <laughs> well that skits us something, right? Okay. So uh, our, well, I love this scriptural statement in our religion that says God is no respecter of persons or personalities. How many are finally getting to the point that our personalities are, really don't need much attention? How many get that? Yes. No, no judgment, it's just our hearts are already pure. Yes. I've worked with tens and tens and tens and tens of thousands of people. And my, what I've discovered to be a fact for me so far is that every single person I've ever met is absolutely pure. Absolutely, immaculately pure. Except for the person taking... No, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. That's just a joke. So tonight, in this conversation, and I really feel when you said, David, you said gravity. Man, I was watching your left foot. I do body language, everybody. And his left foot was... Bam, 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 bam. I mean, I've yet to see you ever. I'm, I was going, don't say anything, don't translate, but anything I notice, I'm going to say to somebody, you. And literally, new understanding, 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 coming in. <laughs> Left foot. Everybody got it? I mm mean, -hmm. it was rapid fire. Absolutely rapid fire. So That's a great example of body art. <laughs> Expand a little bit on body language. Well, and I'll demonstrate. Tonight we can do, we can enter a shift in consciousness for our permanent victory of life. How many feel what I just said? Yes. Yes. You want to have energy moving through you. Yes. Great hand if you do. Yes. How cool is that? Yes? Me too. I'm like, oh, <laughs> 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 I, um, I, I have this decree which is I'm calm, poised, peaceful, all that. And inside I'm going, yippee, I am kind. Anyway. 
So tonight, and I'm in my sacred space because David and Yemaya for me, first of all, Yemaya is one of, is a sister for me in decree. We've done, we'll talk about this tonight. We just completed a series of videos which are now available in the public arena. And Yemaya and I and a number of other folks helped. And we uh, talked about decreeing. And some of us have devoted our lives to our to decreeing perfection and heaven on earth on our planet, and you are one, my sister. You de devoted your life to this, and I have to. But a little bit different focus, which I'm so grateful for. And every word turns into flesh in some level. The word, scripture, the word becomes flesh. Decree a thing, and it shall be established unto you. So this illusion, which doesn't exist, can only appear apparition if we take our attention off the truth of our being, turn away from the light of our being within and around ourselves and each other, and put our attention on this illusion that only has the amount of life force in it that has been given to it by another human or many human beings. And again, there's no life force in itself. I'm going to get that. Yes. Now this is so big because a small group of people in a community can change their entire community and their entire country, whatever it may be. Please feel what I'm saying. How many immediately felt electrical charge for yourself? Raise your hand if you did. How many know that's true? Yes. 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 And I believe the language, well, I, I teach quote unquote conscious language really to prepare people to remember what's already in their heart. Pure speech, uh, scripture says, Zephaniah 3.9 says, I will return to you, uh, that's I am that I am, that's our own I am that I am, <coughs> will return to you, and you is the perception of separation. So it's really our God self in us speaking to us through some blueprint or mechanism. I, I am that I am, will return to you pure speech. And then one of the translations I have, I found, it took me six to put all this together. I, I am that I will return to you, perception of separation. That's after the fall from grace of believing in the fruit of the tree and the knowledge of good and evil. I will return to you, pure speech. And then it goes to, it says, where, when, you call upon the name of the Lord, which is what? I am that I am. I am that I am, in unison, aligned, and it shall be done unto you. Now here, all scripture is written in parable. It goes on to say, in no other way will I write this to you, will I give this to you. Most people, many people, I affirm in the past, don't have a clue that scripture is parable. All of it. It's consciousness. Yes or no? Yes. yes. So let's, uh, no judgment to anything. That's not the point. It's let's us wake up to the blueprint in all scriptures, not just one particular yes. frequency. I mean, know there's a lot of truth out here. Yes. Yes. So, for me, right now, we have an opportunity to literally shift where we are in consciousness. I believe Yamaya, I'm mean, speak about this because I we've had these long conversations, and when an individual decrees and decrees and decrees and decrees and keeps joining together with the truth, through the I am statements and many others, but this particular one is I am. A, a frequency has begun where an instantaneous manifestation is just already agreed to. Grace has already been called for. How many understand what I'm talking about? Yes. Yes. So the illusion only can exist if we feed it. Lack can only exist if we feed it. In other words, acknowledge it, dialogue about it, fear it, stress it, blame it, shame it, hate it, got to put it, whatever. That's the only way it can exist. And if we would just simply stop, like peace be still, and know I am God, the illusion is over. And then I believe in the, the idea of reversing which means to re-say verses, verses, speak. Revise, which means revision, visor, re-see it. 
renounce whatever is the illusion, which means rename, noun, name, renounce. And instantaneously, how many have experienced instantaneous manifestation? I'm going to get it. Yes. And how many know you had, except by grace, which I do believe in, absolutely, how many realize the shift you made in consciousness provided or helped or sped you up to the, to the grace? How many get that? Yes. Yes. How cool is that? Well, how about systematically? <laughs> systematically. That's my deal, is finding systems of perfection. How about systematically from this moment forward walk yourself into your true existence? How about that? Now notice how quiet it was. The whole room could have gone, yes. Seems what, boring. But the only reason we may not have is because the old self is going, oh, excuse me. Yes or no? Yes. How many have an old self? Careful. Good job. How many have an old self? Yes. Now everyone say, I am my new self. I am my new self. I like it. Yes. I like it. Yes. I like it. yes. How, many, how many am it? I am my new self. So the system, and that's what we can do tonight, the body language can let us know what's going on. And it's really intimate and accurate. And it's a conversation. It's not just like, oh, you don't believe it. Oh, you're, whatever. No, it's way more intimate than that. Way more sacred. Way more moving that foot. Man, that was awesome, dude. I mean, and when you said gravity, it was like, okay, we're going to rock tonight. And language, just our spoken word, can reveal usually three words or less exactly where we are and what to do about it. So we can use body language, wow. We can use our spoken language, wow. We can use symptoms, let me get that. And they will reveal exactly what we're asking for that we have yet, not, have yet a clue about. We can use life situations. And it'll, our, like scripturally it says, not religion again, it says, your greatest weakness shall be your greatest strength. Then it goes, not kind of, not maybe, no, it doesn't say that, but it's not kind of, not maybe, not it, it's shall be. How many are thrilled now to go into your weaknesses and turn them into strengths? Yeah. Yes. Not a lot of enthusiasm. <laughs> no, no judgment. How many went, sure. <laughs> How many love to hang out your, your weaknesses? Exactly. How many, how many were taught weaknesses are bad? My bad. Come on now, how many were taught that? Okay, I mean, I mean, even not cool at all. Yes, I mean, not sure that you know, you might, you might just be a redneck here. Nope. Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> you might immediately go, did you do that, honey? <laughs> Thank you for that codependent. Right. So tonight we can do all kinds of stuff. So those that have played with me some, anyway, what would you like to do tonight? Live translations. What is it? Live secret party translations. Okay, got it. Anybody else? What would you like to do? I stuff. Bio-optic. Bio I love the eye stuff. I the eye stuff. stuff. That works for me. I know what that is. I am, I can't know. I know what you meant. I'm going to learn a little language in. I, and they'll be in everything I do, just okay. so you know. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I'm with you. How many like to have a little communication yeah. skill? Yeah. Yes. How many like to be fully matafu? Yes. yes. That's my own word. Everyone say matafu. <laughs> I like a little humor as I go. Anybody else? Yes. 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 I mean, I really move through stuff that I know I petitioned my great God self and whoever else up there in heaven I went to go, I'm right, going to do this service already. And I know I got down on my knees going, and may I have humor, please? <laughs> I know I did, because I mean, I, I seriously, I, I, they probably even baited me. Oh, no, no. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> You're good. <laughs> I'm not going to be good. All right, then you can have it. All right. <laughs> so, yes, we'll do languaging, we'll do body language, we'll do bio-optic. What else? Um, talk about transforming codependency and co-empowerment in relation Yes. <laughs> That's all I want to talk about that. <laughs> all right. Uh, cool. How many have been a little codependent? <laughs> what I have to share, share with that is get over it. No, no. <laughs> it really sucks. And the fall from here's I'm going to build a little bit of a blueprint right now in my view. 
Um, my particular path, I started out way Native American in my focus, went to really, in addition, adding, 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 went into the Eastern uh, traditions very full on. I mean, for years and years and years and years, Eastern traditions. And also metaphysics, quantum physics, and always involved in health, herbology, homeopathy, hydrotherapy, acupressure, iridology, um, whatever else. Anything ology I was into and still am. And, and consciousness and decree and affirmation and prayer and sacred texts and ancient texts. And they all came together in the operating system of our consciousness. So for me, right now we're all operating on all cylinders relative to the microcosm, the macrocosm, as within, so without. Everything shows up all at once. And in my view, this is what's so amazing, is almost, if not everything we see in this octave through the eyes we currently have, I'm going to say that, no judgment to anyone, just possibly, is built on the consciousness of having eaten from the fruit, the metaphor, eating from the fruit of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. I mean, we've all progressed, yes or no? Yes. 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 And, the, you know, Scripture says it this way. We as a humanity, potentially, metaphor, whatever it is, were supposedly afraid we would be cast around the world without a name, so we, as a humanity, started building, a, through our technology, building an outer temple, Tower of Babylon, to make a name for ourselves so that we would not be a cast around the world without a name. And that that I fear is upon me type of thing. So God goes, and this is the, what the scripture says about it. It's fascinating to me. It says, we had better confuse their language. We had better confuse their language, for there is not anything they cannot do. Well, here's the deal. We are the we. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And we had better confuse their language, the, the being who believes they are separate are a they. Yes or no? Yes. Yes. So all, there's only one God. How many got that? Yes. Yes. And we are all that one God. Yes. Yes. So say, good God. Good God. Good God. Yeah. I reckon. So I can prove it just like that song. Okay. So we had better confuse their language for there is not anything they cannot do. Maybe this is true. That's the point. And again, eating from the fruit of the tree, metaphor of the knowledge of what? Duality. Good and evil, yeah, duality, and immediately falling from grace, yes or no, mm -hmm. and becoming embarrassed. Now it sounds like a joke. Did the word embarrassment exist when we were in union with our God? No. 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 And did we ever have to figure out anything to do to cover it? Yes. No. yes or no? No. No, no figuring necessary. Now think of those are two words that think of our whole language structure. Want, can't, need, should, try, it feels. It feels like I feel that you. You cannot feel that anyone. That's not a feeling. That is not a feeling. It is not a feeling. Everyone say it feels. It, it feels. feels. Just say it. It feels. It, it feels. feels. I feel. I, I feel. feel. Say it again. It feels. It, it feels. feels. And I can show you this in your eyes. I can show if you actually have disassociated yourself from your spirit. And what are you here for? Uh, to merge again, remember, re one, re one, reconnect with your spirit. Yes or no? Yes. 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 How many get it? Yes. yes. And how many ever say it feels? It, it feels. feels. I feel. I feel. Any difference? Yes or no? Yes. yes. Let's do this one. Ever say the money. No. My money. My money. My money. I mean, like my money, my bad. <laughs> We're going to spend your money, but I'm going to receive my money. No, okay. Now, the, the, the amount of babble, confused language that we built the illusion on surviving with the ultimate belief in dying and coming back and doing it again and again and again and again until we remember we are I am that I am. And raise our physical form back into light. How many know you can't get rid of energy? Yes. yes. Let's say you take a hydrogen atom and you split it in half. What do you got? Boom. <laughs> you, got you got a lot of energy for a long period of time. Yes or no? Yes. yes. 
So how many hydrogen atoms are in your physical form? Oh, uh, oh my God, that's about right. And think about it. We have <clears throat> the power of God. We are, I am, the power of God in us. Yes or no? Yes. yes. Waiting to harness, the word becomes flesh. Decree a thing, and it shall be established unto you. Wow. It has to be a thing, though. Not toward a thing. That's where specificity is so important. So we have eaten from the fruit of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. Supposedly, they said, you know, we had better confuse. That's all of us go, we better mess up their language. Of, for, we had better confuse their language. Listen, for there is not anything they cannot do. That is stated in a way so we don't quite understand what's being right. stated. I mean, it's hard to follow that. Mm -hmm. yes. That's a reason for that. All this is set perfectly until, for those who have eyes, let them see. For those who have ears, let them hear. Does that make sense? Yes. Yes. We, oh, we will remember. And the illusionary mind, the separate mind, the, it can't follow that. I'm going to get that. Yes. For there is not anything they cannot do, which means what? We can do it. We can do it. Everything. Anything. But notice it's not stated that way. And we did this. There is no outside God. And there is no other God other than I am. How many have read that one? Yes. Or yes. say, I am. I am. So, again, add a little bit in this in the most practical language understanding, systems of language, body language. There's that conversation going on at all times between all of us that frequently our head doesn't have a clue about. We're like, how are you doing? Not too bad. I got this one. I want about you. And the head's going, nice weather. <laughs> I mean, seriously. Yeah. I'm going to get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. I mean, one guy might be going, I love you, you know, with a beautiful woman walking by, and the other lady goes, You are completely ugly. And they had that conversation with the dude, maybe not even getting a clue. I'm going to get it. Yeah, I'm gonna, yes. I, I've read that before. <laughs> Come on now. Two people can be in relationship and not know at all what they're saying to each other. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I can show you tonight, potentially, what conversations you're having. What your spirit is actually saying to you. Mm. Mm. And that's exactly that's what it sounds like. Perfect. <laughs> How many here? Mm. I call it, where's the me? Where's the beef? Mm. Watch. That was your emotion body going, mm. <laughs> How many heard it? That's right yeah. on it. Three, I, I mean, I had 300 people at the same time go, mm. <laughs> It's like a pasture of cows or something. No judgment. It's our feeling world. Mm. Not our head. I want our head doing that. I'm going to get it. Yes. Yes. I'm here enthusiastic to find your true nature. Mm. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Double mm, mm. Right on. That means available emotional and, and there's a couple tricks to this trade. There's, this is a system. I've got a sheet here about Mastery Systems University. I recommend you, it's on my website as well, I recommend you study our school because there, it's just 40 years worth of application, application, system, application, application, next system. I, had, I was married to the coolest person I've ever met on the planet. And we had 17 years straight up of finding how to say this stuff consciously. And you know, subtle, Helena, right? This is one of the most brilliant people I've ever met. She slept once every three or four days. She lay down once every three or four days. She was on the planet for 47 years. And that's all we did was how do we do this consciously in our own metamorphosis. And sit, I'm a system boy, so I systematize it. Clear? Mm -hmm. yes. That's my incarnation. I really believe this. Well, now it's laid out. Got it? And you can, I mean, anyone here who's done it for a little bit is as good as I am on the topic. In their own way. Mm -hmm. yes. Is that true? Mm -hmm. Yes. 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 Yeah. No. Yes. <laughs> Come on, no. I mean, <laughs> Because everyone goes direct. Yes. How many get that? Yes. yes. Everyone say I can. 
I can. I am. I am. I will. I will. I choose. I choose. I have. I have. I love. I love. I create. I create. I enjoy. I enjoy. Now try this one. I want. I want. I need. I need. You should. You should. Some of you are like tanking right now. You never say cancel clear. I recommit. I recommit. I can. I can. I am. I am. I will. I mean, like, ah. There's three words, and I'm here going, ah, or whatever. Yes? Slower vibration of it? Yes or no? Yes. yes. So, falling from grace and being in bare ass. How many get that? Yes. yes. We've all had the experiences we need to know that separation sucks. Yes or no? Yes. How many, how many are way overdue yes. for union? Yes, go ahead. What was that? Separationsucks.com. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, let's not even make a website out because it it's so sucks. <laughs> technical term. What's yeah, that? Technical term. Yeah, technical term. I like that. So, we are, in my view, it's so fascinating. I was watching your foot and you said gravity. It's time. Yes. My tour, this tour, my tour, what I'm doing this particular trip for two months, it's time. And of course, I hope he would say, what? No time, right? Just now. So there's no need. It's okay if you do. There's just no need to get ready. It will happen in the twinkling of an eye. Like a thief in the night. Which means it will just have happened. How many have ever heard the statement, before you have asked, God says, I have answered. Yes. 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 That's how much we are loved. But notice, before you have asked, and yet we still get to do what? Ask. Ask, ask. ask mm -hmm. which means decree. Mm -hmm. Shape what we choose with our tongue and make sure what we, we are saying matters. And as long as what we are saying matters to us, it will turn into physical matter. Clear? Yes. yes. Now, the challenge, opportunity, or problem with this is, well, no, one is there is no problem, it's one of my jokes, but it's true, and it's true. The problem is, we cannot settle anymore. We, and anything less than our heart's highest choice contains within it self-sabotage. Uh, this is so big. I watch you. I mean, your bodies will start having... Even micro-movements, I can see what's going on for you. I can show you this. It takes a bit of time to lay it out there. And how many could hear what I said but had something in your body? No. Anything less than your heart's top priority, highest choice contains within it self-sabotage, which will mean we will... When we pick something easier, we will fail. Yes. And their scriptural idea on this is he, not gender specific in scripture, there's no punctuation, there's no gender. It's fascinating. He who seeks to save his life loses it. Mm -hmm. This is really important to me. And he who seeks to, you know, who gives his life has it forever. Mm -hmm. Wow, think about that. That if I, if I, based on fear, hide my light or my, you know, hold back. It's been said that God says, um, and God is I am that I am. Everybody got that. It's not some mm -hmm. outside God that I'm in this conversation. I'm going to use some of these language patterns. God will spit us out of God's mouth if we are lukewarm. That's this, I believe that to be absolutely true. Anything other than yay, yay, or nay, nay is a sin, error, missing the mark. How many get that? Yes. Now, Bob, how do you feel? Well, basically, uh, I'm uh, exploring the possible. Did I answer the question? No. 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 How many are really good at not answering the question? That <laughs> keeps the eluded self alive. The moment we go direct, we step through the veil. Know the truth, it sets you free, no matter what the truth is. So again, I'm going to come to this moment of if we have eaten from the fruit of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil and fell from grace and became embarrassed and da 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 we've had a confused language system all of our life to this moment. 
lineage upon lineage, however all that works. Maybe it's just genetic memory, if those that believe just only in genetic memory and only one life. If there are many lives lived until we get it right, Groundhog Day is, the movie is kind of like what I call it. How many saw the movie Groundhog Day? <laughs> <laughs> awesome. I mean, yes, it, it's so the deal. Like, how many get, you know, I mean, he kills himself back the next day, same music. I don't know. Got it? We're here. Think about it. Our Creator is all powerful. Do you think we'd only have one life? How many get, do you think death is an impossibility? I believe death is not a possibility because we, I, how many have messed around with energy and realized energy keeps on trucking? Yes. yes or no? Yes. Crabgrass, let's talk about that. I'll kill you, you're bad, you're bad, you're bad. And he goes, yeah, wait a month. How about bamboo? That's where bamboozled came from. How many get it? How many have ever felt bamboo? How many know about bam bamboo? Oh, let's put a little stand in the back. <laughs> Pretty soon your house has got it. Yeah, 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 with bamboo. All right. Is it possible that your prayers have already been answered? Yes. 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 I'm going to say it again. Now, our conscious mind, our rational mind, doesn't have a clue, potentially about what I'm asking you. I'm, I'm actually speaking into our heart. Is there any need to struggle anymore? No. no. Are you sure? Yes. yes. How many How many could? Yes. Yeah. How many can? How many could go and go? How many have ever done that? I've read about it. <laughs> yeah. We'll see. So, every symptom... <clears throat> is translatable into the strength of your being that's returning. Every single eye or iris sclera and pupil reveals the mission you're here for and what you have yet to bring into your world. The eyes, the, the pattern of our eyes do not say how conscious we are. They only say what we have yet stored in our feeling world to bring to light. The moment we bring anything, new, new upgrade, pattern, embodied, transformation, our eyes will change. That's called affirmation or confirmation. Embodiment. Or either that or everyone say, I choose. I choose. That's what I look at. I'll sneeze as I choose. Okay. Yes? Can, can you say that thing about the symptom? You just said. Certainly, yeah. I did. How about I choose to get that one? I choose to get so it. So be it. Now, you were really aligned with that right on. Never said I didn't get that one. I didn't get that one. So even whatever you got, you would have just kicked out with those words. By your words, you shall be just. Yes. So everyone said, one more time, Bob. One more time. I said, I have not a clue what you're talking about. I am so confused, and I didn't hear you, and I'm not ever going to hear you because, no. All right. So, so every symptom, how many have ever had one? Yes. 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 Three. How many of you have ever had a symptom? Oh, yeah. Yes. 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 Thank you. Every symptom is a deviation from some truth, a call to adjust something. Most of us look at the, in the past, and even our modalities look at the symptom and attempt to treat the symptom. In, no, it just not, doesn't really work. Whatever modality anybody uses, also address what is this turning into. Does that make sense? So do you have a symptom? Yes? <coughs> Every got mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, nay, nay. Do you have a symptom? Yes. Yeah. Oh, good. Now, the reason I'm doing that is I play this game. Everyone go, watch, honey, will you marry me? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How many wouldn't be satisfied? <laughs> <laughs> How about this? Is the check in the mail? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. How many might wonder? <laughs> so, so if I demonstrate this, you know, you tell me because you're in full charge. I ask everyone to be completely quiet while I'm showing the symptom stuff, and I'm asking all of you to vote. What's your name? Gail. Gail. I'm asking you all to vote Gail's permanent victory in light. Yes. yes. Clear? Yes. yes. So I'm make an agreement to be. You know, present for her, yes or no? Yes. 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 And to vote her yes. permanent victory in life. Whatever, in other words, some people, what does that mean? Love her. Yes. Uh, encourage her. Agree she is her high, whatever you would give yourself in that state. That's all we can really do. So, do I have permission to facilitate you? Yes. Good. 
That was good. So what's your symptom? You, I tell you out loud. Yes, ma'am. Okay. My, the left side of my tongue burns. Ah. Oh. Also, I, I speak in different languages because I eat out a lot at various restaurants. <laughs> <laughs> I just found this the other day. It's one of my eyes like, ah, I got a new one. So forgive me. So, I mean, frequently I'll be Asian, I'll be Hindi, I'll be whatever. So forgive me ahead of time. I love accents. If you have an accent, I will ask you 50 questions. I'm not really asking you generally anything. I'm just loving that you talk. <laughs> so with that in mind, I love, so I was just doing an Asian one, and forgive me, it's my nature, I love accents, so. Um, uh, tongue expression. Burning tongue. Feminine suck. So let's just start with that. So have you expressed something to a female figure that's toxic? No. Okay. Um, has a female figure expressed something to you that you hate? Yes. Have you forgiven this person? Uh, I have to do it on a daily basis. I didn't ask you that. No. It, no. <laughs> <laughs> no judgment on my part. Vote or victory, yes or no? Yes. Yes. So whatever we judge in another becomes us. Our subconscious doesn't know the difference between we're all one. And so if you go, you are this way, I immediately, my subconscious hears that and becomes that. So mm -hmm. true forgiveness is always forgetting. So is it time to forgive this person? Yes. What would you have to give up? A way of thinking. Specifically, dear. I love when people do that. Are you talking to me? <laughs> she had that, what? What would you have to give up? The thought that I would have to give what up. What would you have to give up? <laughs> I love the sounds of it. We have channeling going on by four legged. <laughs> what would you have to give up? Vote or victory, stay present, everyone. Have, did you hate what happened? It's aggravating. I didn't ask you that. No. Um, is that true? Yes. Okay. With permission, anytime somebody wrinkles their forehead, it's usually a half truth. So what you do is, yes, and with a wrinkled forehead. So trust, maybe there's more. You're paying some dues, yes or no? Yes. So did you love that it happened? No. So what's the opposite of love? Hate. Hate. No, not that necessarily the kind that would be so bad. And yet anything, it, this is one of the descriptions I've read in one of the I'm discourses that really helped me a lot. Even mild dislike is a form of hate. Mm -hmm. okay. I love this statement, you know, don't always love it, in the sense of, oops, and God says you're either for me or against me. How many get that one? Yes. 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 How many realize, all right, we're in the final <coughs> shoot here. We're coming all the way up. We're moving up into our full nature, yes or no? Yes. 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 I mean, how many are like 50% of an orgasm? <laughs> <laughs> Some people go, well, <laughs> but other than, how many like 50% of your oxygen level? No. No. So how many have been playing way small compared and satisfied with it? Or it's okay, or I'll settle, or I'll make do. Not anymore. So again, everything that you, in other words, this person that did this to you was you doing it to yourself through this person. Yes or no? Yes. In the, in the energetics of union. So is it time to forgive this person? Yes. And, and so what will you have to give up? Hate. Of what? Hating what? Myself. Your tongue. Yes. And it would be your self-expression. Yes. Of what? My self-expression of myself. Of what in yourself? What about yourself? That was my the, impression of myself? How many? I, I, that, was well, that was awesome, man. You did great. I, you, you went from like a, something like, I don't know, to uh, my... So what? What would you have to give up? My hate of what in myself? First words. Ask your heart. My motherness in myself? 
Well, you're kind of leaving your body right now. We call that in the system becoming a Mickey or Minnie. How many notice she's headed on up here into the higher realm? Well, yes, it's nice to stay in your body. How many have figured that out? I actually almost sound like Pluto now. I can hear Pluto. So she went all the way up to Pluto. It's so cool. That happens a lot in the communication you just left, so I forgive myself for. And when we get this, the symptom will be over. Gone instantly, usually. Boom, done. Yes? Getting warm in there? Yes. Good. I like that. Yeah. That was a little of that codependent sound, huh? Yes. Why? <laughs> Thanks for sharing. <laughs> How many? How many? <laughs> Call homeopathy, yes or no? I master it. Ah, 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 ah. How many got it? I just did what you did. Yes? So I, I have to give up not loving myself or something, yes or no, in my expression, and I now what? I choose to love what? Myself. My expression. Oh, say it again. I choose to love my expression of myself. Mm, say it again. I choose to love my expression of myself. Say it again. I choose to love my expression of myself. Cool. What's happening? Well, my tongue's still burning. So there's probably something you get to say to this person, yes or no? Yes. That sounds exciting. <laughs> How many notice that? Yes. How many know you're going to have to? What? How many like to postpone the inevitable? <laughs> no, no, no. Don't do that. Yeah. How about just go step off the plate and get it done, son? Yes. Yes or no? Yes. I mean, I mean, free yourself and free them. Yes or no? Yes. Whatever you don't want to do, go do that. Make a list of 15 things you don't want to do and go do them. Have them done by tonight. Maybe send the email to every single person that you'd rather not talk to and say, let's talk tomorrow. And by the end of tomorrow, you will be the happiest camper on the planet. Or you'll be dead, one of the two. <laughs> <laughs> but he who seeks to save his life has already lost it. <coughs> Confirmation. How about you, Victor? Yes? Yes. Everybody, yes or no? Yes. yes. And this is... It's, the, the body language thing, you, you didn't go stoic so much on us. I mean, movement, you were mostly just present on it. So it's a big topic. How long is, have you had the tongue thing? How long 17 have you had years. Oh, so that's called an acute stage. I mean, chronic stage. Yeah. And usually when I do body language, I make sure it's acute. So that it's a little more current. Mm -hmm. Something that's been entrenched for so long as a stronghold is the kind of, most of your interaction when you were, even now, it was blink, 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 no judgment, I'm just showing. Mm -hmm. Blink, 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 blink. Every one of those are filters. Separate, 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 separate. They're filters. They're not good. Like, Bob, is it check in the mail? Yes. How many know? Maybe not. How many get it? Yes. yes. Maybe not. So again, those are filters. You could, you know, once you got in the system, you would see, mm -hmm. and you can know for yourself, I'm filtering. Mm -hmm. So seventeen. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is that yes? Yeah. Yeah. No. No. Mm -hmm is mm -hmm. backwards. Is <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. yes and no. Yes or no. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cool. So body language is it is bigger than all that. That's this is the the beginning of turning around into. Our greatest weakness should be our greatest strength. There's way, every single symptom is a call for some action. Yes? yes. yes. And we can go forever, seemingly, without addressing the symptom because we haven't known how to address it in the past. Now it's time, I believe, for all of us to realize that our physical body, everyone touch your body, is the temple of the Most High Living God. Touch it again. And what is this? The temple of the Most High Living God. Let, look at that. Look at the words. Experience. The Most High Living God. 
Scripture says, ye are gods. We had better confuse their language, for there is not anything they cannot do. By your words you shall be justified, and by your words you shall be condemned. In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God. The Word was God. Because the Word is shaped into matter, just like we were all shaped into matter. We are here. And now it's our job to resurrect what we have. And inside of every experience seemingly of lack, limitation, or struggle, or weakness, is our strength, <coughs> our training. We are, how many know you're way more than your physical body? Yeah. Yes. yes. And we are all here right now, learning pleasure, pain, right, wrong, good, bad, so we can transcend it. Yes or no? Yes. yes. Or give it, resurrect yes. ourselves through it. So every symptom, every single symptom, I mean, most people that I work with, it, it it's a current state we can, whatever, they're over it. I mean, so many, even here, I remember many times I've done body language here, and mm -hmm. the person who had a symptom or whatever, you know, they come up, it's gone, it's over. How oh, cool. Everybody ought to know this, yes or no? Yes. 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 Master, I mean, it's, it, you're already doing it. We all don't have to think body language at all. You don't have to program, you don't have to do NLP to figure out how to, your body is hooked up and wired to do it. How many are glad about that? Yes. yes. Can I will, I can I will, I can I will. Hey. No. Hey. I'm going to get that. I really love what you're saying. Uh -huh. I mean, you know what I'm talking about. Yes, yes honey. I'm very, very happy to take out the garbage during the football game. You don't look at, oh, I, I, I am. <laughs> That's really mundane, and yet it's real. Yes or no? <laughs> Look at that. Get out of here. But it's even more than that. Every one of you right now is going, one moment, one more breath, one change in your physiology, and you would realize who you are. Oh, but your illusion would go, no, 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 please don't, please don't. La, 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 don't listen. No, 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 don't do that. Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Because if you do, I will have to die. <laughs> I will have to die if you do that. Do not, no, 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 take your it and then blah, 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 I forgot I'm back. Here you go, buddy. Here you go, illusion. I'll worry about you a little bit more. I'll judge so and so, or I'll judge myself through so and so a little bit more. Have to forgive them every single day. Because I haven't done it yet. But that's the way I keep my tongue burning. I got that burning, yearning, yearning, to smack her upside the head, but I ain't gonna. So I put the karma on in my mouth. Just so I don't. You get a sense of what I'm talking about. Because I might start laughing really hard here. I like to have a calm before he's peaceful. Yeah, right. Every one of you is a white fire being of life. Yes. Yes. Yes or no? Yes. 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 Every one of you is a glorious white fire, all powerful being of light. Yes, yes or no? Yes. yes. How many want to realize your strength? Yes. 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 I just tested you. How many want? Mm. There's more than beef over there. How many didn't know I said the word want? How many thought I meant how many are glorious being alive? How many want to be a glory? It's tricky. Yes or no? Yes. Yes. How many realize a certain test here for you and for me to wake up? How many want to wake up? Yes. yes. No. <laughs> I'll keep testing you until you get an A. That's all there is to it. I'm gonna say it again. Say it again. Say it again. Awake. I am awake. awake. I am all right. So again, <laughs> so uh, like I said, I committed to humor. What can I say? So here's the deal. Every one of us, this thing called pure speech, or I call it conscious language, is in our heart already. It's not really something we can learn. We can remember. Seems like we learn, but ultimately, we speak from our heart here and now. And every word we say happens. Mm -hmm. And that's what's starting in this moment to happen on our planet, is mm -hmm. every single word is getting the frequency of instantaneous manifestation. 
good or bad. I have seen people, cancer clearer than I have, gone in a couple seconds from life to death by what they said. I've seen the reverse. I've seen people make a new choice, and they're here now. I'm one. I'm, I'm living proof of that. My wife transited from black fungus because she didn't want to be here. She didn't like what was here. I had the same black fungus. I was dying. Made a commitment. I'm here now. Clear? Yes. yes. You say, I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life. Now again, this is not religion stuff. Everybody got that. These are the laws. Whatever that is for you, it is what it is. And your every thought is producing the rest of your life, and so to speak. Our internal dialogue becomes the rest of our day. I'm going to get that. Yes. yes. So if I'm worrying, I'm actually attracting in exactly what I don't want. Right. Correct. So it's very important to read exactly verse and understand how to reverse pattern, patterns, how to receive things. I'm going to get that. Yes. Yes. So if you hear yourself say, I want love, what, how do you upgrade it? I am, I am. I am love. I mean, everybody can do this once you get the game of it. The purpose of community for me is to come together and basically practice. And, and for me, both victory, see perfection with each other. Mm -hmm. That's what's going on all over the country and other places as well, other countries. How cool is that? Vote right now, vote each other's victory. Yes. 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 Tangibly <clears throat> make an agreement, vote, actively vote each other's victory of light, permanent victory of light right now. Feel what I'm talking about. Yes. 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 Now make that permanent victory of life. Yes or no? Yes. yes. Per make it permanent. Thank you. Make it permanent victory of life. How many like permanent? Yes. yes. How many am permanent victory of light? Yes. 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 Say I am. I am. My permanent victory of light. My permanent victory of light. I express my truth. I express my truth. Cool. How many like it? Yes. yes. I can finish my introduction now. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. To finish my introduction, everything that Bob's gone over, he's touched a little bit on linguistics, on conscious language, on imagination activation, on eye reading, on uh, conscious or uh, body uh, translations. What's really great about Bob's way of teaching is when you enter into a room, it's you go in a, in one door and when you come out the other door at the end or completion of whatever work you're doing with him, you can do whatever he does. And I, that is so clean to me. Far cleaner than uh, any other technology I've ever come in contact with. And that's why I so love um, being in Bob's presence. It's nice and clean. I feel clean. And so sometimes I feel like I can take a shower after other people. With Bob, I feel clean. <laughs> so he hasn't showered ever since I've known no. 